blank. Enter your lies mm, now. Tequila into... Find the truth. Let's take a look. Me and Kayla would think alike because I picked, I said gasoline. And it was also. Oh, Toad. Nice, Toad. Me and Toad. Hmm, kind of spooky. Me and Toad. Well, I'll be darned. <laughs> and nobody fell for some of these ingenious lies. They turned tequila into diamonds? Wow. Wow. Yeah, this diamonds. Two, which means all point values are doubled. And don't let that defibrillator sit unused. It disappears after round two. Time to pick a category. Okay, here's the question. Demeter Fragrance Library sells a cologne that blends the odors of white flowers, mahogany, and oriental carpet. The cologne is called blank. Write your lies now. <laughs> Hurry up, use a suggestion if you can't think of it. Okay, oh here we go. Find the truth. <laughs> Fart knocker. <laughs> Who picked what? That was a big one. Wow, that was some major league bluffing right there. Well, you guys blew it. Who would name a, a fragrance? For when you want your date thinking about the time the funeral the home. one died. And the rest of these lies didn't fool a soul. That's a horrible answer. That's a horrible, horrible name for a clone. Alright, right, Shadow. Your, your turn. Pick. Well, we ain't waiting forever. Okay, here's the question. In 1990, the Prime Minister of New Zealand appointed a man named Ian Brackenberry Channel to the very odd position of New Zealand's official blank. Input your lies now. I think I actually know this one. It's like we got an achievement. Hit 
Hit the live for me button if you can't think of something. Okay, which one's the truth? <laughs> I don't know who put Leprechaun, but that's a good one. Except for it's not Irish. If it was Irish, maybe. Alright, let's see what everybody picked. Stoneman wrote Stone Mesa. He humbly requests you go to his LinkedIn page and endorse him for wand skills. And nobody picked any of these other lies. Oh, I take the lead. I'm taking the lead, everybody. Time to pick a category. All right, Stoneman, here you go. The Pope? Okay, here's oh, the question. Gosh. In the year 2000, before a crowd of 50,000 people in St. Peter's Square, Pope John Paul II was named an honorary blank. Type in your lies now. I can't believe I wrote that, but that's okay. I can't believe I wrote that. Hurry up! Use a suggestion if you can't think of anything. Okay, here are your choices. John, John Cena fan? Uh, Harlem Globetrotter? <laughs> I don't know which one it is. Uh... <laughs> Let's see what everybody selected. I, I don't know who put glow. <laughs> oh, man. Afterwards, the Pope swished a three point Hail Mary from the Basilica. And we're done. Oh, man. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. Climbing the ladder board. You're about to enter the final fibbage. All right, we've got the final Just round. The final question, and it's worth triple. Good luck. Here's your final fibbage question. The name of the sport where participants knock down bowling pins using a football. Enter your lies now. Absolutely, Lee. Okay, there's a truth out there. Find it. Falling? Pin linning? <laughs> I like pin linning. Falling? Froth? Okay, what pin did everyone pick? Pin linling? <laughs> I don't know what it is. Is it cricket a real sport? 
Caleb? That was a good answer, Caleb. Ping linging. Ping linging. <laughs> and that's it. Froth is frisbee goth. I didn't know that. Oh boy, look who the winner is, everybody. Look at that. Dun, 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 dun. Oh shoot, cancel. Cancel. I didn't cheat. All right, everybody, there's the new code. JDSX. Oh, I gotta go with the donkey noise. I think I got Prison Architect open still. Hey, look at that, this is still open. We should probably close this. The code is right on the screen. It's GDSX on the bottom. First is the worst, second the best, third the nerf. I haven't heard that in, dude, I haven't heard that in so long yet. I think you're right, sorry, I, I'm the loser. I'm the worst. The Great Fapsby, that's a good name. <laughs> uh, all right, anyone else? I think, um, okay, someone's joining. Yaya's girlfriend, okay, nice. Anybody else? We got room for one more. Got room for one more. That's cool, yeah. I'm Fapsby, okay. Third has a treasure chest. Alright, anybody else? Anybody else? Last call, last call, here we go. But I could be more than that if you wanted. No? Okay. Seven of you. You know, in some cultures, seven is a lucky number, which is too bad because with me here, that makes eight of us. Oh well. Oh, and uh, anyone else can get in and join the audience. Yeah, you can play along for your own personal score and you can like your favorite lies. Let's do this. <laughs> This is round one. You'll get 500 points for everyone you fool. And you'll get a thousand for finding the truth. And you've got a helper, the defibrillator. It eliminates all but one lie. Only one use per game, so I'll take being a nerd any day. All right, pick a category. Okay, ooh, oh, oh, says oh, jam, oh, oh, says jam. I don't know how to say my name backwards. Okay, here's your first question. In Minnesota, some refer to the game Duck Duck Goose as Duck Duck Blank. Write your lies now. 